So I think maybe a part of us kind of knew from the beginning. I literally called my brother and I said, I think I met the man of my dreams. Brian, wow. Brian is the love of my life. I didn't think that love at first sight was real until I met him. I need some Janet Jackson music, man. I'm I wasn't you. looking for love. I wasn't looking for a relationship. We started texting and talking on the phone. We came close like that. He said, I, ha I have something to tell you, very important. He sent me a long message telling me that, you know, he's positive. There's a lot of rejection, especially when it comes to, like, dating. Some people can be cruel and mean, so being exposed to that type of treatment. He kind of explained it to me, and I was like, it's fine. It doesn't change anything. It made me feel amazing. The plan was just to go visit him and have a good time and become friends after that, but it went, it went beyond that. And, and like I said, I mean, we fell in love. <laughs> His reaction in many ways kind of made me feel that, that there was no reason for me to hide who, who I am. I'm, I'm just dealing with a chronic illness, just like it. You know, there are people who have cancer and have uh, uh, diabetes or other illnesses. I think it's just that the stigma really makes people afraid and scared. His support really, really made me feel more at ease. Yeah. <laughs> One of the things that I, that, I, that I really wanted to do with my now husband was to add an extra layer of protection. Consider PrEP. PrEP is a once daily pill that helps prevent HIV. Like an extra safety precaution. I get my PrEP through my primary doctor. I have insurance. They give a little test every time I get a refill, so it's once a month for me. He's been on PrEP for, for more than two years now, and, and you know, he's, he's negative, and we want to keep it that way. The fact that I'm a detectable makes it almost impossible for me to transmit the virus to him, and that's something that makes me feel relieved. Brian generally treats my HIV as any other health issue. It's the most important thing in the world to me that he takes his medication because I want him around. We're just like any other couple. We like to hang out, sit and watch TV together. I'm the laundry guy. He hates doing laundry. <laughs> Don't let HIV discourage you from going for true love. If I did, I wouldn't be with my beautiful husband today. For more information about supporting a loved one living with HIV, go to virginia.reddit.org.